Butte, Montana. We are 11 hours, 46 minutes into our 10 hour break, which is totally fine. Okay, you guys ready to go? 3,489 miles is what we all did last week. So good job, you guys. You're really good at this. It smells like air fried broccoli in here. I've never tried warmed canned chicken. One time I tried air frying some version of that, like in a patty form, and it was the worst. But just know that it's not happening. But I will give you this right here. Let's go. Clancy, Montana. I don't want to be too dramatic or anything, but I freaking love Montana and I want to move here. Somebody should tell Leah. Also, somebody should hire me on their ranch in Northwestern Montana. I don't have any ranching experience, but I can vlog about it. If you ever get the chance to drive Interstate 15 from Butte North, do it. Enough of that, it's poop time. I love it here. Helena, Montana. This is where my mom was born. I used to come here as a kid for family reunions. I loved it here. Anyways, let's get unloaded. If there are any real estate agents that watch this in Helena, please find me a house. I'm not gonna lie, this is one of those deliveries where I kind of hope my company just forgets I exist. And I'll just, I'll just stay here for a while. I mean, Helena is gross. Nobody come here. Ugh, that's, it's disgusting. It's dirty, it's loud and noxious. It's the worst. 68 degrees out. I love Montana. Have I mentioned that yet? Be careful, this is really hot. Yep. empty. Let's continue to wreak havoc on the supply chain crisis. Bonner, Montana. I have unloaded at this place before. Last time I was here, it was 24 degrees below zero. That's almost a hundred degrees difference than what it is right now. I don't know if that math checks out or not, but anyways, let's make a pickup. load is strapped we are not allowed to tarp on site so i'm going to take it down to the truck stop and do it there let's go tarp this thing the time is 12:08 p.m Twelve fifty six PM. Let's go. Please rate my tarp job. All right, so it's one o'clock. I still have 30 minutes before my two hour break is completed and I get my time back because I need it all. And 
never from the same row. The diet is going really good, actually. Thanks for asking. Two hour break is over. Let's go trucking. Fourth of July pass, Idaho. Can you guys keep it down? Listen, you don't want to be on the internet, so you quiet down back there. Hey, look, this is my friend Ken Ben. Ken, this is my friend Ken. I'm gonna cut that a little hot dog. Do you want a little bit of dog No, you just do you, and I'll just be here. This is my lover. <laughs> And we used to work together like 20 years ago. Before they were born. Before they were born. They don't want to be on the internet, so I'm not going to show their faces. We just randomly saw each other. Did you rate my tarp job when you drove by? Oh, I was going to tell you to pull over so I could write you a few tickets. Yeah. I don't know if you noticed, my front flap has come undone. That's not good. I'm going to do a level one inspection right now. Okay, we're done. That was my buddy Ken and his daughters, two of his four girls. I love that guy. I've known him for a long, long time. But now we gotta start driving again. Let's go. Dead Man Pass, Oregon. Pendleton. Oh. I'm up on top of Cabbage Hill. And my eight hour break starts now. That's right, eight hours. Don't you dare go telling Jesse. But I have to split the sleeper so I can get to this customer earlier. Trust me, it'll all work out for the best. Anyways, this video is now over because I gotta put it together and then go to bed. Thank you for watching. I love you guys. What's up guys? This is Justin from Boise, Idaho. You know orientation's on Monday.